Hey, what is up guys, it's KKB. I'm sorry for the delayed upload. I was going to make a special announcement for 75K, but unfortunately it isn't ready at the moment. I made this video because of the Indianapolis road course drama last weekend, and I thought this would be a fitting video for this time of year. Hope you guys enjoy the video, and as always, make sure to like and subscribe, and feel free to leave suggestions down in the comment section down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy the video. Ooh. Got one off, and that is Matt Kenseth. Hard Big hit yeah. as he came down. Wow. Caution is out for the fourth time today. And you see him right here. He's on the outside, and Junior gets up over the curb before he gets there. Junior gets into his left rear, but at the same time, if we if we have that other shot, yeah, um, watch, watch Junior's right side of Junior's car as he hits the curb. Boom, and it knocks, and it, him, and it knocks him straight yeah. to the left, straight yeah. to the left. And we've talked about it before. It is really tough to go through this area of the racetrack side by side. There's just not enough room. Well, it was a pretty calm day in Indianapolis until right here. We have no, I'm going to tell you, I have no idea what happened when I saw this live. William Byron, the first to hit it. The curve comes apart in turn six. Joey Logano, so thankful to see Joey Logano jump out. That scared me, that hit. But watch right here, the 24, an explosion tears something off the right front of the car. Here comes Joey Logano. I mean, it tears literally wow. the whole nose off that yeah. car. Uh, and straight he goes. The carnage continues. Uh, l listen, we have some calls. I'm going to get right to them. Just real quick, I want to get... I've seen a lot of things, didn't see this one coming. No. No, I didn't no. see this one coming. And we were just talking about it. As long no. as you've been in this sport, you just never know what's going to happen. I, l this is... We can't have this, clearly. No, yeah. no. Right? Well, clearly. Did we all agree on yeah. that. Yeah, clearly yeah. that's yeah. unacceptable to have the racetrack come up like that. Clearly that's unacceptable, and that's got to be looked at. You know, how does that not happen again? Yeah. This is not the only racetrack in the world that we go to that has steel curbs. Yeah, right, right. right. You know, so it's not unusual that, to have steel curbs, but clearly it failed, and I, I know they're working hard to fix it. And, and you know, what a shame, because we, it was good racing. Great, well, like, yeah, all was weekend a, was we had good racing, good and racing now that's turned around. into the story. Right oh. up. Oh, my goodness. Eric Jones, backstretch chicane, Steve. Let me guess what he hit. Wow. That's big. I mean, he's already made contact. Couple yeah, hours. There's a car in front of them. Oh, took a peek there around Ryan Newman, and there's no real estate. Oh, man. He, again, holy Toledo. We hit those turtles, and you literally fly in the air. A ways back. You must catch him dramatically. Pay attention to 31. just as we went green on a restart earlier. Oh, Tony Stewart goes for a spin. Into the inside wall at pit entry. Caution is out. So Tony was second. Marcos Ambrose was third. No, nope. he just lost it. Hmm. Still been some moisture down there, made it a little Absolutely. slicker than he anticipated. Absolutely, I think that probably had a lot to do with that. And how he spun and didn't catch after he bounced off the inside guardrail, the end of that pit wall too. That was pretty fortunate. Watch this. Bang, and a car straightens up and he catches it without hitting anything else. Yeah, but Michael, it's just like Larry said, and we know there will be another caution. I mean, we Larry nailed it. These drivers, a lot of them lose their mind at the end of the Whoa, year. Whoa! Like right Reagan there. and Edwards, there they go, into the wall, hard. You were saying? Yes. Right. <laughs> I said there will be another up, caution. Joey, I don't think, uh, we're Some of them will lose their mind, and in the process, they're probably going to lose their car. Here's a look at what brings out the fourth caution of the day. You'll see Carl Edwards way on the outside, but by himself. Now he's got to fight for some room. This is the same place that uh, the 78 and the 55 had trouble. This time, though, this, the 19 of Carl Edwards bounced over those curves and bounced into David Reagan. That was a battle for seventh, or battle for sixth, actually. Bubba Wallace with a massive hit there, Steve. Yes, he did not have a good day yesterday. The bad weekend continues. The difference is 
we were expecting to see maybe a couple spin outs for Bubba Walls, but this is this is a KO. This will not be a uh, return to the action. Man, it's heavy, heavy contact on that left front. Let's take a look. He Oh, he just gets loose and he's oh, nowhere to go. Man. Oh, wow. And that's a moment that you're thankful that wall is designed to move. Is correct. Oh, man. Huge impact there. And, Steve, you've mentioned it. That backstretch chicane is so inviting because it just it, it invites you to carry so much speed through there. But watch Corey LaJoy in the seven, what he does when he hits the curving. Yeah, so he's back. He's getting ready to enter the frame right now. And watch this. I mean, that car has got to be a couple feet off the ground with the right front. I mean, Airborne. Yeah, watch. There's another view of it right here. He's going away from your right-hand side of your screen. You're going to see takeoff. I mean, that's unbelievable. Huge damage to that car. Racing for third place at the inner loop. We've seen these two have some battles right up here. Wow, that was close to that guardrail, Andy. Man, if they hit the end of that guardrail, it would have been huge. Look at this. Yeah. Oh, he did hit it, I think. Hey, yeah, I kicked that harder. I just have to question thinking you're going to outbreak Marcus Ambrose into one of these corners. You got to remember, oh, trouble back in the back. Ryan Foster turns it around. Still no caution. The cars keep going underway. Oh, my. That's Jeff Jefferson on his Corey. roof. Barrel rolls. Hard, hard roll. Wow, look at the wind and neck comes down. He looks like he's okay. Jeff Jefferson, There's great short show. track racer from Washington State. It's the mogul here, pretty much out of control. Nothing he can do, hard down on the right front. Man, hard impact. See the roof flaps come up, but at that point it was too late. His teammate right behind him in that 10 car, Jim Warren. Another tribute to the Roll cages of these race cars. NASCAR has got these bars and the placement of these bars just right. Look at that barrel roll.